Well, I thought I'd just update you on what's going on here. I have the bike apart because I'm doing some work on the boards. Um, I drove home in the rain last week and there was it was raining really hard and there's probably about half an inch of water on the road. So uh, what ended up happening is um, the front tire was whipping up a whole bunch of water. The front cover here did its job for the most part but I found out after I got home that um, quite a bit of water was getting on the sides still and some of the boards in here were just absolutely soaked. Um, and you can probably remember from before that I was using that clear heat shrink and that clear heat shrink worked really well for the most part but it still does allow water to get in and once it's in it's pretty hard to get it out so it's not a very good waterproofing solution so I just took the boards off here and um, silicone conforming, conformal coating them so that's in progress I did notice a bit of corrosion on a couple of the boards. Uh, I think they were the boards at the bottom there. So it is a good thing that I'm doing this because uh, that will prevent any future corrosion. So those are the remote boards in progress there. I did already uh, do the main board and the display. So those are all done. They're pretty much, I wouldn't say waterproof, but very water resistant. So. Uh, yeah, that's what's going on. Uh, one more thing that's, that's happening tomorrow, actually, is um, I'm getting together with my friend, and we're, he has a motorcycle, so we're going to go for a ride. And, and yeah, I think that's going to be some good fun, so stay tuned for that. Well, I got the bike back together. Um, I silicone conformal, I, sorry, silicone conformal coated all those boards, and I, I probably put about, you know, five coats on each side and it uh, ended up being pretty thick in the end so I think those things are definitely uh, good to go they're pretty water resistant now so I uh, don't expect uh, those boards to corrode anymore or have any problems ever um, on another note uh, my friend uh, I guess he had some problems with his bike we were supposed to go for that ride today and I think he mentioned that um, one of the oil bolts I'm not really sure exactly but one of the bolts for the that holds the oil in his bike uh, broke and the bike started leaking oil and uh, he didn't have a replacement bolt so he ordered a new one and it'll take uh, a couple days to get that in so I think the plan is to go for a ride next weekend so I'll have some uh, footage of that uh, probably next weekend I hope anyway if the weather's good um, I'm also working on something uh, very quite complicated actually um, and it's probably going to take uh, several days, if not most of the week, to shoot. Um, so I'm working on that. I'm not sure when that will be posted, um, but it's uh, pretty interesting. And uh, I, yeah, I don't know what else to say about it. You'll just have to uh, see when it comes out. But um, yeah, I'm working on that. And I also got another really interesting one that I've tried to shoot several times. And every single time I've tried, I've kind of uh, messed up. So. I'm going to try to do that one again this week too and uh, hopefully I'll have that up by the weekend. But I'm just letting you know that i got some good stuff coming so uh, stay tuned.